a lot yeah. colder over the weekend, but Monday it's going to start to warm up. Oh, good. I don't know about you, Adriana. I've always liked ice cream when it's cold. Yeah, right? I mean, go figure. <laughs> All right, so it is chilly right now. Yes, mid 40s to the mid 50s, and the temperatures are going down, but it's gorgeous outside. This is our West Jeff Medical Center camera. Look how pretty the city is. Now, what really makes those temperatures drop when you have clear skies and light winds? Our skies are not clear on the South Shore. We've got a little bit of cloudiness, kind of seen an uptick lately. But I am expecting the skies to clear out there. You can see that dry air that's moving in. So let's zoom in. And it's really some high and mid level clouds just on the South Shore, not on the North. So as we look at that forecast model, we see the clouds moving out. We see the temperatures dropping mid 40s to the mid 50s. And frankly, already at Bell Chase, there temperatures did drop into the mid 40s then they got a little bit of cloudiness it went back up but morning low temperatures upper 30s to near 40 for the north shore and the mississippi gulf coast south shore in the mid to the upper 40s so the takeaway from it is it's going to be chilly in the morning you're going to need a coat a jacket maybe some gloves a little bit of a breeze during the day too with that northeast wind at about 10 to 15 so here is a look at the forecast model it's going to be a gorgeous day tomorrow. Sunny skies, high temperatures in the upper 50s. Now, wait, watch what happens. This high pressure moves right over southeast Louisiana and south Mississippi in the morning for Saturday. When that happens, temperatures are going to drop. On the North Shore, 30 to about 32 degrees. Protect your plants, your pets, your pipes are going to be just fine. Mississippi Gulf Coast, probably low to mid 30s. You've got the potential for some frost on the Mississippi Gulf Coast, also on the North Shore. For the South Shore, low temperatures in the mid to the upper 30s. So some potential over towards, say, Bell Chase that you could have a little bit of frost. And then your high temperatures are going to be warming up as you go into your Sunday. Look at this. We pick up a southeast flow, high temperatures upper 60s to near 70. At the beach today, it was just gorgeous. Look at the sea oats. Anthony Pollard sent that in. And then Nola Spice Design said, look at all of the beautiful light in the sky and also look at the beautiful lights for celebration in the oaks. Here is a look at that waxing crescent moon. It's 40% full and it's going to be a full quarter tomorrow, the first quarter. So this is a look at our low temperatures this morning. They occurred between 9 and 11 o'clock in the morning. The high temperature actually occurred at midnight because it took some time for that cold front to move through. So you can see the cold front at midnight was already through Baton Rouge. Right now, mid 40s to the low 50s. So it's chilly out there. And with that wind blowing, it does make it feel a lot colder. So here is a look at the forecast. Nine in the morning, about 51. Three in the afternoon, 57. Saturday, that's when it's going to be really cold in the morning. Highs in the upper 50s. Then as you look at Sunday, we're starting to warm up. But then look, Monday for the Saints game, it's going to be raining. Also the first day of winter. And notice how we warm up. Chris Christmas is, of course, on Friday. I'm celebrating Christmas on Thursday because I'm working Friday. A little bit of confusion about that, but you can see our rain chances go up. All right.